Hey, what's going on everyone with Realme 6 phone, Realme 6 Pro phone. I'm going to show you how to connect the Samsung Galaxy Buds Gen 1 as these are very popular wireless earbuds and the price range of them right now are under $100 brand new. So I'm sure you are probably one of those that have it. So let's get started and show you guys how to pair these up with the app. And of course, yes, you can actually access the app on the Play Store for Realme 6 and the Realme 6 Pro so of course the app is this one here the one that says galaxy wearable app and throughout this process you will be prompt to install an additional plug-in so that you can make the compatibility of the gen 1 galaxy buds perfect so of course as always we want to first go into the main settings of our realme phone here and then we go into the main bluetooth settings and then turn it on from here. And this basically allows for our Bluetooth settings to be on and searching for nearby devices. And while it's doing that, let's go ahead and simply just open up the case lid for your Galaxy Buds Gen 1 right here. You should have a green light. If you don't have a green light, if it's a red light, just close it out, go ahead and plug it up, charge it up, and then come back to this video so I can show you how to connect these properly. So if they're in a green light, they should have already shown up on your Realme 6 phone here under available devices. So just go ahead and tap on that one time. And it's going to say pairing and you might get a pairing request or it will simply just connect it for you automatically. And once you have gotten to this part here, it is not over yet because we want the Galaxy Buds Gen 1 to work with the app. So with that said and done, let's now go into the wearable app here. We'll tap on that one time and it's going to turn on and it's going to say get started. So we're pretty much going through the process again, but that's just how it works. It doesn't work with the app instantly as you connect it. So get started. You'll look for Buds or Buds Plus. You'll tap on this one time. And it's going to ask you all of this to allow location, storage, and all of that stuff. So you will have to do it initially at the first time. So let's go to settings, turn it on, and then, of course, just uh, agree, whatever. You know, you don't have a, really a choice. And then you're going to go through the others with allow, allow, and then allow only while using app, allow. And then it's going to say scanning for wearable devices. And now you'll see Galaxy Buds. And this is like connecting it a second time, but really and truly, it's just about connecting it with the app and this is the part where I was talking about uh, saying that you will need the plugin to control your earbuds and all that so press ok it's going to take you into the play store for you automatically and you'll just simply select install it's going to run the installation process for you in terms of um, running it it's just a small file here so let's just wait for that and it's going to say that and then once it says it's open here is what we are going to do to avoid confusion and this always works better if you do it this way we'll close this out i'm going to close out the wearable app and i'm going to close out the bluetooth settings i am going to close out the earbuds here itself and then when i open it back up again it's going to show me that it has auto reconnected to the bluetooth settings and now we'll go back into the wearable app do this again let's get started and then go into here the buds buds plus It'll say let's pair up. You'll see the same thing again. And this kind of refreshes everything because if you did it the other way around straight, it's going to kind of make a loop, give a, cause a loop with allowing access to this and that, and you will get really upset. So just go ahead and allow, 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 allow. And you can always come back here and make those changes. Agree. And then it's going to say this. You're going to have to go ahead and maybe toggle between either of these or turn it off or all the apps here. It's going to show you all of these in terms of notifications. If you want, turn them on, turn them off, then next. And then turn on notifications uh, for in the Galaxy Wearable app to hear them. And then of course, you want to go ahead and turn it on. And then this is the part where you have to turn on the one for Galaxy Buds right here. This is the one that you must do or else it will not go through at any given point. So back out once that's done. And then let's press next. And you're pretty much okay. Once you get to the finish option here, just press finish. And it's going to say you're all set here. And this is the part where everything is just simply amazingly perfectly fit for you and it just says here turn on auto run which to use the plugin apps for your wearable devices you need to turn on the auto run uh, for these apps and of course just press ok and you can always go back 
to where it says read notifications if that gets annoying and then of course you can make those changes you got the advanced you got the ambient noise touch controls equalizers and that's pretty much it for the setup here and again to show you that it actually is connected i'm going to take them out of the case here you see they're still connected i'll put it back close it out notice how the app closed it out as well when i pop it open again it's going to auto reconnect and Ta-da! And you're good to go. So that was the full setup tutorial guide on Galaxy Buds Gen 1 with the Realme 6. And of course, if you have the Buds Plus, this works the same way. So yeah, like, share, subscribe, turn on notifications, and thanks for watching.